Magandang araw po sa ating lahat. Right now, we are going to present simple problems concerning efficiency of DC generators. Unain natin dito, calculate the efficiency of a 15 kilowatt generator whose input is 25 horse power. Again, ang efficiency, formula po natin dyan, percentage efficiency equals the power output divide that by the power input times 100%. Ang power output ng generator na ito is 15 kilowatts or 15,000 watts. Ang tangan niyang input power naman is 25 horsepower. So, convert natin muna itong 25 horsepower into watts. In order to do that, the power input equals 25 horsepower wherein in 1 horsepower, Meron tayong 746 watts. Cancel out yung horsepower. Meron tayong 25 times 746. This is 18,650 watts. So, pwede na natin i-substitute dito. The percentage efficiency equals the power output. Again, that is 15,000 watts. Divide that by 18,650 watts times 100%. Cancelled out yung watts. We have your 80.43%. Ito po yung sagot natin dyan. Next problem, determine the efficiency of a generator whose input is 30 horsepower and whose terminal voltage is 220 volts when it is supplying 95 amperes to a load. Again, formula for percentage efficiency, the power output all over the power input times 100%. For our power output, the formula for that is the terminal voltage multiplied that by the line current or yung current being delivered to the load which is 95 amperes. So dito, 220 volts multiplied that by 95 amperes amperes. This is 20,900 watts. For the power input, convert natin yung 30 horsepower into watts. Again, in 1 horsepower, meron tayong 746 watts. Cancel out yung horsepower, meron tayong 22,300 80 watts na pwede na natin i-substitute itong mga power output and power input dito sa ating formula. We have 20,900 watts. Divide this by 22,380 watts times 100% equals 93.5 39%. Next problem, the total power losses of a 10 kilowatt generator is 850 watts when operating at full load. Determine the percent efficiency. Again, the formula for the percent efficiency, power output divided by the power input times 100%. But another way to write power input that is power output plus the power losses. Substituting yung mga given values natin dito, the power output is 10,000 watts plus yung total power losses is 850 watts. This is 10,850 watts. Substitute natin dito sa formula. That is 10,000 watts, the power output. Divide that by the power input, which is 10,850 watts times 100%. Cancel out yung watts. Sagot dito, 92.17%. Next problem, a 5 kilowatt generator has a total loss of 700 watts 
when operating at full load. Calculate the percent efficiency. Percent efficiency equals the power output. Divide that by the power input times 100%. But again, the power input can be written as power output plus the power losses. This is 5 kilowatt or 5,000 watts plus the total power loss is 700 watts. Therefore, power input is 5,700 watts. Substitute natin dito sa ating formula. Five thousand watts. Divide that by five thousand seven hundred watts times one hundred percent. Cancel out yung watts. This is eighty-seven point seventy-two percent. Next problem: A fifty kilowatt generator has a full load efficiency of ninety point five percent. Determine the total losses. So losses naman ang kinukuha natin dito. Again, we have percent efficiency equals the power output over the power input which is equivalent also to power output plus the power losses times 100%. The percent efficiency is 90.5% equals the power output is 50,000 watts. Divide natin ito ng 50,000 watts plus the power losses times 100%. So mag-cross multiply lang tayo. Ito pupunta dito sa taas tapos itong 90.5 pupunta naman dun sa baba. 50,000 plus the power losses equals 50,000 watts times 100% divide this by 90.5% solve muna natin ito this is 55,248.619 watts 50,000 watts plus the power losses. Transpose lang natin ito dun sa kabila. Magiging negative yan. Power losses equals 55,248.619 watts minus yung 50,000 watts. This is 5,000 248.619 watts. Last problem. The percent efficiency of a 25 kilowatt generator at full load is 88%. Determine the total power losses of the machine. Again, percent efficiency equals... The power output divided by the power input, which is also power output plus power losses, times 100%. Substitute natin yung mga values. 88% equals power output is 25,000 watts. Divide this by power output plus power losses, 25,000 watts watts plus power losses times 100 percent again cross multiply natin ito pupunta ito sa taas at ito naman ay bababa 25,000 watts plus power losses equals 25,000 watts times 100 percent Divide this by 88%.
and this is 28,409.091 watts. Transpose natin ito sa kabila, magiging negative. Power losses equals 28,409.091 watts minus 25,000 watts. Therefore, the power losses equals 3,409.091 watts. We'll have more problems sa mga susunod natin mga videos. Maraming salamat po.